The carpet is so clean and fluffy. But not for long. Hi, Mom! I'm home! Don't step on the carpet! No! What? Mom put the balloon down just in time. This could be more useful when deflated. Now it won't spread mud. Look at my cool kicks! They're limited edition. <sighs> my carpet is saved. The family is sleeping in a tent. Huh? What's that noise? What was that? I think there's a real monster out there. What's wrong, sweetie? There's something outside. Ah! They're gonna eat us! Honey, wake up! What is it? What's happening? There's a monster outside! Oh, silly. Those are just leaves. It's gone when you point a flashlight at it. It's so bright! Our eyes! This doesn't seem to work. Ah! You're right. It's like staring straight into the sun. Oh, I know. Mom is making a lamp out of a heart-shaped balloon. Cover it up with a tissue and start painting. Add a cute bear and glitter. Cover that up again with a tissue and paint some more. Then add stars this time. Repeat the same step, tissue and paint. Now that you've molded the shape of the balloon, we can pop it and get rid of it. I'm sure you can already tell who this lamp is gonna be. Huggy Wuggy! A Huggy Wuggy lamp? That's so cool! Now they can finally sleep in peace. This sand is so fun! I'm gonna fill it up with water. Just a little bit more. It looks like a volcano. But I'm gonna mold it into a ball. Something's inside. Let's soak it under the water to see what's hidden. Well, hello there, Huggy Wuggy. Where is the rest of his body? Wow! Oh no, the lollipop! This is a cute monster! Mom, Dad, look what I found! That looks fun, sweetie! Oh, where's my lollipop? It's covered in sand now! Is she gonna eat it? No! Stop! You are not eating a sand-flavored lollipop! I wanted to eat that! Use this instead! What is that? Wow! He's eating my lollipop! He's just holding it for you! And he's protecting it, too. You can place it on the sand anytime you want now. Cool! My lollipop is safe! I love this gadget! I don't think a kid should be holding such a sharp knife. What the? Cake! Dad is making something fast, like the flash. Is that a knife made out of paper? Use this! It works just as well as the knife. Phew! That was close. Shoot! Another problem! No, not the socket! Not today, missy! I've got a plug protector to keep you from shoving things inside. Huh? Where did she go? Bye, Dad! Her fingers! Use these door stoppers. Wow, Dad is like a superhero! Phew! It's a relaxing day for camping. Never mind. Dad seems to be looking for something. I have three splinters in my hand! Three? Oh dear, this is bad! Aha! Uh -huh. I found the tongs! Are you crazy? You can't use those! Just stay back and let me do the job. We have a first aid kit for this. I present to you the pump gadget. This will suck out that nasty splinter fast. One down, two to go. It's gone! It doesn't even hurt! No need for tongs then, I see. Mom always knows best. The family is going on a vacation. Wait, where's our daughter? Melanie, let's go. We're leaving. Are you here, Melanie? I'm not sure she'll fit under the carpet either. Maybe she's in her room. I'll go check. There you are, silly girl. Melanie, we have to go. Huh? Why can't she hear me? Melanie, we have to go. What's going on up there? Why can't Melanie hear anything? Let me check her ears. It's full of wax. How will she be able to hear us now? Oh, I have an ear cleaner. Let's get to work. It might tickle a little. Ew, Melanie basically made her own ear muffs. This gadget will get rid of all that nasty ear wax. Good thing this ear cleaner comes with a light show. Yay! She can hear us now! Yay! She can hear us now! 
Hold on. Dad's ears are full of wax, too. Really? How was Dad able to hear through all that slime? Hold on. What's that noise? What's going on? Why is the lamp not working? I'll use a flashlight then. Okay, let's go investigate. Detective Mom is in the house. Are those handprints? Someone's been making a mess around the house. Let's see what this stain is. Hmm, chocolate, just as I thought. Uh-oh, the culprit is behind that door. Gotta open it carefully. I hope it's not some kind of chocolate monster. The trail of handprints continues. This is her daughter's bed. Are you under there? Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, phew, it's just Melanie craving a midnight snack. If you really want chocolate, I've got a better idea. Huh? Let's see what mom is up to. Use the spoon and take a dip into the jar. Make sure to coat it just like that. Now add some sprinkles all over it. And voila! It's like a chocolate lollipop. This is amazing! Mmm, it's so sweet! Looks like Melanie and mom are going somewhere. Ready to go? Yep, all done! I put them on the wrong foot. How can you even get that wrong? You know what? We'll solve this. It seems Melanie can't tell which one is left and right. Mom's gonna put a sticker to mark which is which. This side goes on the right. And the other half goes on the left. Huh? This image doesn't seem right. Aha! This way! It's just like a puzzle. I'm ready to go. Hey, ladies. You guys ready? Dad, look! Dad put on his shoes incorrectly, too. Good thing I have extra stickers for you. Melanie is really addicted to video games. Don't slouch like that. Fix your posture. Whatever. Oop, she's doing it again. Unbelievable. Sit straight, okay? Hmm, my daughter can't have bad posture. Look, she's like an old woman with a hunchback. That can't be! No! We can't have you slouching like that. We need to solve this right now. How is a belt going to help? Are you gonna hurt me? Please don't! I promise I'll fix my posture! Sit properly. Is he making a seat belt? Oh, I see. He's tying Melanie to the chair. Let's see if you'll still slouch after that. What a smart hack, Dad. We'll fix your posture in no time. You can only pack so much for a trip. But it seems Dad wants to bring the whole toy box. What is it? What's happening? I'm sick. Is that a cough I hear? I have a solution for that. Just dip the lollipop into the cough syrup. Stop that. She can eat it. Okay. What is Mom looking for? Aha! Uh -huh. I found the mold. I'm going to make a homemade lollipop. Place a toothpick in each mold, then pour in cough syrup. Let it freeze, and voila! A medicine lollipop! Here you go! Wow! This is yummy! Lollipop? Can I have some? I want a lollipop too. Well, I guess Dad can enjoy it too, even if he's not sick. Lollipops are for everyone. Beep beep! You'll get a speeding ticket at this point. Huh? Whoa! And those poor toys! What a tragic accident! Oh no! The clothes! Bicycles are made to be used outside the house, after all. My poor toy! The poor toy got hit by a bicycle. Help him! Look at his broken arm. This is an easy job. Dr. Mommy is in the house. She's all suited up. Let's start the operation. Can we save him in time? First things first, check for the pulse. We have to cut his arm off. To put it back properly, we have to remove it first. Tweezers, please. This is practically his shoulder bone. We need to attach his arm. Then we can stitch it back up with a thread and needle. Mom is a professional at this. Look how awesome her stitching skills are. Surgery is done. I recommend bed rest for a few days so the stitch will heal. Wow, his arm is okay. My job here is done. 
What about Barbie? Well, being a mom and a surgeon is a full-time job. <laughs> the family is about to board their flight. This is so funny. Hmm. It seems Melanie didn't get enough sleep last night. She's lost in dreamland. Her snoring is so noisy. I'll just put tape over her mouth. Well, that's one way to solve the problem. Perfect. <laughs> I'm kind of getting sleepy, too. Huh? What's that noise? Dad is snoring, too. It's so noisy. I know. A sleep strip will cover up his snores. That seems to work really well. It looks like Dad has a cute pacifier. <laughs> Uh-oh. Mom's asleep, too. Who's gonna cover up Mom's snoring now? Score! Yeah, that was a good shot. Another point for me. My turn. Yes! They're supposed to be packing their bags for the trip. But I guess a DIY basketball game won't hurt. Uh-oh. It's Mom. What are you guys doing? This is not how you pack your clothes. Hold on. This box is giving me an idea. Let's see what Mom is up to. She's cutting out the cardboard into pieces. Now she'll bring it all together with tape. Make sure to secure every corner. This way the cardboard can be foldable. It's done! You can fold your clothes with this. Let's give it a try. Put the shirt over the cardboard and fold it up on the sides. Wow. Then at the bottom. Wow! I did it! Maybe they should turn this into a game and score a point for every folded shirt. Huh? And look! They fit well in the suitcase. It's dad's turn to fold his clothes. Like this? Oh, I got it. This is too easy. What a cute picture. Honey, pack your things. I've got your backpack. It's so ugly, Mom. I don't like it. Why? I think it looks cute. Oh, well. Look at this cute bag. Now this is the kind of bag I want. Maybe there's something pink around here. Aha! Uh -huh, the trash bag! Melanie's got a unique taste for a bag. Oh my, the trash! Why are you putting your stuff inside the trash bag? I'm ready to go! I packed my stuff. Check out my cool new backpack. It's like I'm wearing a cape. That's not an appropriate bag, sweetie. What should I do? Oh, a puppet! Looks like mom got an idea. Wow, a puppet bag! It has so many colors! And I can play with it, too! Okay, I'll definitely wear this. Thanks, mom! It's perfect! Cereal is my favorite meal of the day. Legos on the floor are never a good idea. The cereal spilled all over Melanie. Ouch! My foot! You ruined my hair! Guys, what is going on here? Oh my gosh! So many Legos! I was just playing! Don't you feel bad for me? Yikes! It's so sore! Wait! I have an idea on how to clean this up! Mom covered the vacuum tube with socks to gather the Lego pieces. They won't get sucked in all the way. And it's easier to bring them back to the toy box. Mommy is like a special agent with her cool hacks. It's time to go to sleep now. Toys go to sleep too. Nighty night, dear. Sleep well. Ugh, sleep! Now we can go. Free time for mom and dad. Something's not right. No sleep! No sleep! No sleep! <laughs> Come on, dear. Please! Ugh. You go to sleep. I won't. Help! Do something! Go to sleep, mommy! <laughs> dad is closely monitoring the situation and something has caught his eye. I know! Look what dad brought. A cute unicorn sleeping bag. Yeah. What a brilliant idea! It's so hard for parents to lay their kids down to bed. But these parents know what to do. Now the kid hops into it by herself. Because it's so cozy and cute. It's so much fun to sleep this way. You are a genius. Good night! We, we 
finally did it! Let's go before she wakes up. <laughs> Almost done? What a brain twister! Dad! Ah! What? I need my hair done for school! Looks pretty good to me. Here, take a look at the picture! Huh? What's this? I want my hair braided like that! Uh. Looks like dad is gonna have his work cut out for him. Well, um, I guess I'll just try my best. And dad starts twisting and twirling the hair. How do you even use this? Let's see what he ends up with. And I'm done! Voila! Looks great! What do you think, honey? It is! What is this, dad? I need my hair done normally! I'll get laughed at! Oh, I, um, might need to think of something. What's that? String? Hair? Braids? I know! Huh? I'll be right back! Ta-da! With this, we can make your hair look really cool! Now just close your eyes. Okay, got it! <laughs> Let's see how this works! To start, Dad is going to pull the hair through the center. And then simply let it do its magic. It wraps all of the hair in a really cool pattern with no effort. He simply needs to hold it. And done! Already? Wow, Dad! You're the best! I'm off to school! Another problem solved. No more braiding for me. Huh? Come on, don't be so stubborn. Let's go brush your teeth. But I don't want to! Want it or not, you have no, to. I'm not gonna! I'm asking nicely. Brush teeth now. I'm not brushing my teeth! Not so fast, young lady. Aha! Dad is trying to put a toothbrush into her mouth at all costs. Charlotte is so agile. Dad is really struggling to keep up with her. Success! Dad did it! Yuck! I hate toothbrushes! I'm out! Let's go, Mr. Owl! Dad can't let his kid go without clean teeth. But he has a perfect idea. <laughs> Here comes Charlotte. She is very cautious this time. But she's still curious. Dad? Oh, good! You're here! <laughs> I have something for you! It's a cute owl who cleans your teeth! Here, you love owls, so why not try this? I think you'll love it, too! Just bite around the mold! Charlotte is suspicious, but it looks cute and harmless! Well, okay, let's see… like this? It vibrates! Like a small dance! So fun! Hot, hot, hot! Dad is bringing soup for his son. But oh no! He doesn't see it! Whoops! We have an accident here! Ouch! 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 That's hot! That must have hurt! I heard screaming. Soup? It was an accident, Mommy! These bowls are not safe! So easy to spill! Easy to spill, you say? Hmm. Aha! Uh -huh. I know what to do about that! Mom poured the soup in a different spill-proof bowl. And now their son can eat without worries of tipping the bowl over. Yay! Don't be afraid. Everything will be fine now. I made sure of that, honey. Oh, I'm so thirsty. Oh, mm. It's so hard to open it. Maybe if I bite it off? Dad saw what the kid is doing with his teeth. No! You can't do it with your teeth! Let me help you with that! See? Here you go! Mmm! Water! Oh dear! Seems like the boy really was thirsty! Thanks, Dad! Wow! How did he manage? But wait! Water bottle? Dispenser? This gave me an excellent idea! Look at this cute water dispenser for the boy! Now he can have water whenever he wants, without having to struggle. And he won't drink too much at once. Great idea, Dad! Mom arrives at the kitchen, but she can't believe her eyes! Son! What is… <gasps> happening? There's yogurt everywhere! Son, can you please… Please stop doing that! Oh, I'm warning you, mister! Son, I've told you no playing with your food! Sorry, Mommy! Wait! Spoon? I just remembered a cool gadget for this! A cool gadget? Here! A yogurt dispenser! Just squeeze it! Oh! Wow! What a cool idea, Mom! 
Mmm, delicious! Thanks, Mommy. It's really cool. Yes, it worked. Now to have breakfast myself. Huh? Ha ha ha! You splashed yogurt on yourself, too! Seems like Mom needs some help eating yogurt as well. I need to clean up? But oh well. I might as well try the gadget myself. Hmm. No more spilling yogurt for me. Charlotte really needs to use the toilet. But does she know how to? Ah, Mom! I fell in! I'm stuck! Oh my! Are you okay, baby? Just stuck, Mom! Then let's try to get you out. Right, on three. One, two, three… Yeah! Ah! 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 Ouch! What did I fall on? Wait. Thanks, Mom! Poor Charlotte. But Mom seems to be thinking of something. I know. This time, Charlotte comes prepared. She puts on her own seat so she won't fall in. And all set. Is everything okay, dear? Oh, sorry. I'll just leave you to it. Charlotte is enjoying her time drawing. Dear, I'm back from shopping. Yay! Look what I drew, Mommy! It's a… tomato? I can't even tell. I… Uh, thanks, dear. It's really nice. It's an apple, Mom. It's fine. Oh, I really messed up. An apple? Oh, I know just the gadget. <laughs> Look what I got you, dear. A drawing projector. Here, let's give it a try. Wow! Thanks, Mom! We can draw anything with it. Come on, let's see what we'll draw. Let's start with a cherry. Just gonna turn the switch and… There! Wow, wow so, so cool. cool! Now just take a pencil and try drawing it. It's gonna be such a pretty cherry when you're done with it. Yeah, just a bit more here. A line there. Looks great! Mom, I'm done! Come have a look at what I drew! Oh, already? Let me have a look. Oh, a realistic cherry! Looks really pretty! Oh, and what's this? A pineapple! Looks so creative! And here… What? Oh my! Such a realistic apple! You are such a skilled artist, honey! My little genius drew this! Oh no! A monster is coming out from under the bed! Watch out, Charlotte! I'm coming! What's wrong, honey? There! A monster! A monster? Where? Under the bed? I don't see anything. You sure, dear? Look over there! But there's nothing, dear. Please, mommy, have a look! Okay, just to be safe. But I don't see any monsters here. What is this? Oh, a push lamp. That's cool. I got a great plan. Perfect. No monster will dare approach my girl. Look, dear. It lights up when you press it. We will attach it to the side of your bed. There. Now, if you see a monster, just turn it on, and it'll get scared off. Now, good night, dear. Charlotte is gonna try sleeping again. But, uh-oh! Here it comes again! Huh? Gotta press the light! Oh, no! She did it! Now Charlotte can sleep peacefully. Huh? Oh no! The boy drew all over the table! And he still wants to draw more! I'll make the floor look cool too! Yeah! Stop that, son! Can't draw on the floor! Or mom will get real angry! What?! You two! How did this happen? I leave you at home for an hour and now the floor is ruined?! Then who's gonna clean it?! Me! That's it! You're both grounded! Yeah! Let's not have that! Okay, let's see… a box? Huh, I got it! Let's take this and see. Let's see what's inside. Here, paper. This will solve everything. Paper? Boring! I don't want it! What? That didn't work. Oh no! What to do now? Huh? Paper sleeves? Wait, these might just work! Yeah, let's go! Lay down a sheet of clear film on the floor. Even it out. Yeah! Perfect! I'll draw on the floor now! It seems like that's not a problem at all. And the boy is interested again. And once done, I just need to wipe it off. No sweat. What should I do now? Hmm. This is really tricky. Now dad's playing tic-tac-toe with the boy. Hmm. Got you now, dad! They're having so much fun together! Good job, dad! Charlotte is enjoying a healthy snack. But then suddenly, her loose tooth falls out! My tooth! It's gone! Oh, 
What happened, dear? Are you okay? My tooth came out! Oh my! How did that happen? Give the tooth to me! No! I can fix it! I'll put it back in! Calm down, dear! Everything will be okay! Huh? A medallion? Tooth? Oh, I have an idea! Wait here, dear! I'll be back! Ouchie! I'm back! And I got a surprise for you! Here! A case for your tooth! Isn't it cute? You just need to open it, and then you can put your tooth in it! Wow! That's awesome! Great! Now let me put the necklace on you! That way you can keep the tooth with you until you fall asleep! And then the tooth fairy will come for it! Yeah! I can't wait! And now, before going to sleep, Charlotte puts her lost teeth under the pillow! Hopefully the fairy comes! She seems very excited for the upcoming morning! Okay, now time to sleep! And here comes the fairy! Wow, where am I? I smell a lot of teeth! Aw, she's sleeping so peacefully! Let's see how pretty they are! Now just gotta look under her pillow! What do we have here? Wow, wow! They're so beautifully packaged! This really deserves a prestigious reward! This should do! A bit of money for my hard worker! Just gonna leave it all here! Now sleep tight, princess! Wow! Now that's a lot of money! Mom and Layla are up to something creative! They're making decorations for the cupcakes! But wait! Oh dear! Who draws like that? That's awful! Just look at Layla! She's drawing like she's on fire! Mom doesn't want to hurt Layla's feelings, so Mom will try to take out her drawing secretly! What? Ah! How could you? That's my drawing! Ah! Sweetie, no! I didn't mean to hurt you, I'm sorry! Please forgive me! Let's hope mom knows how to fix this terrible situation! Oh, I know! For this craft, you'll need a few rubber bands. And three pens in the colors you've chosen. First thing you want to do is connect two pens together. Secure them with a rubber band. This is quite challenging, but you're doing great, mom! Then connect another pen next to these two and repeat the same. There it is! Now let me show you how this works! Grab your finished drawing and a blank piece of paper. Place one next to the other. And start drawing by following the lines of your finished artwork. You'll need to use your patience and creativity for this cool hack. Wow. Look! Layla's doing very well! Let's see if the final result will also be nice. Hooray! You did such a great job! See? There's no need to worry. You just needed some help. The cupcakes will look insanely good! High five! And come here, sweetie! What's that? I think dad wants to join the creativity club as well. Is he trying to copy a dollar? Oh my! That cupcake in his mouth won't stop him! What? Gotta make money somehow! Wow! Mom looks amazing! I think she's heading out somewhere! I'm getting ready for a fancy dinner! I'm almost done! I just need to finish my makeup! What's that? My makeup brush! OMG! Seems someone worked very hard with Mom's brushes! It's like a real art gallery! Ah! I don't know if Mom's nerves can take this! Okay, okay, calm down. Everything's under control. Don't touch it. Look, Mom, isn't it beautiful? Ah! This is driving me up the wall. Why? Ah, but I want to paint. Okay, maybe I overreacted, sweetie. I think I know how to help you. Grab a toilet paper roll and a pair of scissors. Now cut one end into even strips. It should look something like this. Ta-da! Now it's time to dip the new painting gadget into the paints and stamp it straight onto the paper! This is so amazing! And my brushes are safe! Wow! That's so cool, Mom! I want to try it! I hope it'll turn out beautiful! See? This is so easy, tidy, and artsy! From now on, I'm gonna use this brush! This is so much fun! 
I'm glad. These ones belong on my face, not in your art club. Mmm, smells delicious. Mom's cooking like a real master class chef. I bet dinner's gonna be mouth-watering. A splash of olive oil, a sprinkle of salt, and pasta. Voila! Hmm? Where are all my pots? Hey, what's that sound? Huh? I better go check that. Bring it on, little kid! I'm not afraid of you! Three, two, one! Ah! Ah! Stop! Oh my god! Are you out of your mind? What's wrong with you both? Give me that! You two! Let it go! Sit down! Where do you think you're going? Get back here! Whoa! Read some books and exercise your brain! Not my pots! Books! That's boring! Boring? What am I gonna do with you two? Oh, I know! Mom's come up with a creative idea! Obviously! Let's find out what she's gonna do with all these pots! The sticks are for you! Take them! And go try to play the drums! Playing the drums? Cool! But I also want to play drums! Okay, okay. Someone's more like a child than a husband, I guess. Hold on a second. There you go. Try this. The grater can be used as an instrument as well. Wow! I like how it sounds! Finally, no fights or battles. Just music. And mom can get back to cooking. One more song, son! I'm tired! I have no more energy. Looks like playing instruments can be as tiring as fighting a battle! Dinner's ready! Grab a plate! Burgers! Oh god! I'm starving! I bet! After all that playing, you must be super exhausted! The food will help replenish your energy so you can get back to playing music! I'm so proud of myself! I guess I'm gonna be the owner of this cool Pots and Pans musician band! The brother and sister are drawing something! Layla's doing so well! Um, Dylan… Well, at least he's trying. Wow! My heart looks amazing! Let's see yours, Dylan! Ew! Hey! Don't look at my drawing! That's some kind of hogwash, not a heart! <laughs> Stop laughing at me! Guys, what's happening here? Stop arguing! Let me see your drawing. Wow, that's beautiful! You have such an artistic hand! I know! Thanks, Mom! I'd like to see yours as well, sweetie. Come on, let me take a look at your work. Huh. Um… Your next one will be much better. I hate drawing! I'm gonna play computer games. I don't need your stupid drawings. Oh, poor Dylan, he's so upset now. Let me see what you're playing, sweetie. Hmm. I might have an idea to make drawing way simpler. I know. Just a second. Looks like mom has some kind of notebook. It's graph paper. Wow, what a smart idea! It's gonna make drawing much more interesting and much easier. Okay, let me try it. Just look at those cute drawings. How nice is that? Drawing like this is so much fun! Lucky you guys! Your mom is so creative! Dylan's a true fan of drawing. Drawing on the table! Wow, that's beautiful! Wait, what? No way! My coffee table! OMG, what have you done? How am I gonna get this off? Shoot! Relax. Easy. Breathe in. Breathe out. Okay, chill. I'm just gonna cover all the mess up with a cute tablecloth. No one will notice. What? 
Not my favorite shelf! OMG! Oh boy! This day's pretty stressful for mom, right? No! Not my dress! No, no, no! I can't handle it anymore! Uh-oh! Someone's in real trouble! Almost done! No more drawing on the furniture! Huh? Dylan! Would you just stop for heaven's sake? Give me those! That's it! I give up! I have a feeling mom's just come up with something. But why the toilet lid? Look! She's drawing on it! And it wipes off so easily! Wow! Yay! Now it's your turn! Is she gonna flush Dylan down? Oh, of course! Now Dylan can express his creativity on the lid of the toilet! How convenient! It comes off so easily! Best idea ever! Just amazing! I think it's about time for a prank! Oh, look! Dad's here! Ah! Who did this?! Let's hope dad didn't pee on himself! Mom's doing such a great job with the chores, right? Huh? What is that? What a terrible stain! Now the t-shirt is completely ruined! Come on, you s And it doesn't come off so easily! What a shame! I guess it's time to say goodbye to the shirt! No! Whoa! What a catch! What are you doing? It's completely ruined! You're not gonna wear it again! No! That's my favorite shirt! I won't give it to you! Hey, get back here! Mom better have something creative in mind. Otherwise, a real fight's gonna start soon. Okay, whatever. Let's try to save your favorite shirt. I think I have a creative solution in mind. No! We're gonna use your feet to make a footprint on the shirt. I've never seen such a thing in my life! Cover the bottom of the foot in paint. Choose whatever color you like. Looks like mom's using pink. It's ticklish! <laughs> I have a great feeling that the result's gonna be awesome. Almost done. Let's stamp. Now it's time to use your hand and a different color. It's gonna be so beautiful! Now get ready to join all the shapes you've stamped. It's a butterfly! Wow! Mom literally just saved Layla's t-shirt and upgraded it to the next level! Now my shirt looks even better than before! I love it! It's easy when I'm so smart! <laughs> Mom! Mom! Look at me! Oh yes, sorry. I get distracted so easily. Hi! Hi! Wow, you look stunning, my love! Whoa! Who is this ugly woman? Oh my, let's hope mom doesn't see this painting. Can I see it already? No, 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 no. Stay where you are. Everything's okay. Mom, please stay still. Forgive me, I always forget. I think dad's super nervous about the painting reveal. Done. Here you go, mom. This painting is of you. What? Do I look like that? OMG! Am I so ugly? No way! I can't let this happen! What am I gonna do? Think, think! I know! Dad has an idea! Let's see what it is! I have a good plan! I'm just gonna take this off the wall! The second step is to take the picture out! And now we can get the plan started! Looks interesting! Come here! Let's try painting mom's portrait this way! It's gonna be more accurate! Honey, hold still! And look at Dylan! I hope it turns out well. No one wants to see mom freak out. Looks like Dylan's pretty confident in his painting skills this way. Your portrait will be so beautiful, mom. Oh, that's so sweet. The portrait actually looks like me. <laughs> Dad's now on a secret mission to destroy the evidence. I love playing in all the balls. Sweetie, come on, it's time to go. No! I want to stay here forever. I'm not going anywhere. Please, I need to use the bathroom. Yikes! 
Stay here. I can't hold it anymore. Much better. Dylan? Dylan, where are you? Oh no! It's empty! And Dylan's gone! Oh my god, where is my baby? What am I gonna do? Hey, you! Have you seen my son? You! Where is my son? Did you see him? This is really bad! How is she gonna find Dylan? Hey, boy! What are you doing here all alone? Where are your parents? You lost? Attention! Attention! In the first hall, there's a boy who has lost his parents! Dylan! Where are you? Dylan! OMG, there you are! My little sweet pumpkin! Thank you so much for finding him! You must take care of your children and always keep an eye on them, miss! I know, I know! Wait! I think I have a great idea! May I borrow your pen? What pen? Oh, oh, pen for writing! Sure! Thank you! I don't understand what mom's doing! Oh, she's writing her number down in case Dylan gets lost again! That's so smart! Wow! Give me your hand, sweetie! Now you'll always find a way back to me! And the bracelet looks so stylish and funky! Here's your pen! Thank you so much! Now there will be no more problems! Where is he? Someone's calling me! Hello? He what? He got lost again? Unbelievable! Is this your son, lady? Yes, my little pumpkin! Thank you so much, sir! Well, at least the bracelet helps! Who keeps leaving trash on the table? Ugh, I better throw that out! What? Oh shoot! Looks like someone threw all the fidget toys away! But why? Hi, Mom! Hey! What are you doing? Did you throw all your toys away? Why would you do that? I just bought them! These are boring! I want new ones! Take your toys back and go play! No! I want new ones! Kids these days! Fortunately, Mom has a plan! Let's see what she's up to! I know! Grab a balloon! Then put some squishy balls inside it! It's super fun! Now fill the balloon with water and tie it up! Make sure it's secure! That's it! You have your brand new toy! There you go, sweetie! Refreshing drinks are always a good idea. Be careful! Oh no! Whoa! Ah! Shoot! My drink! It's all gone now! Don't worry, sweetie. Here, take mine. Yeah, I don't want yours. Think, Dad. Hold on a second. I think I might have an idea. Let's see what Dad is up to. Come here, sweetie. I'm going to show you a very cool hack. Let's put the straw between these two glasses and watch how magic happens. Just like that. See? It's starting! Look how your glass is filling up! It seems that Dad was really prepared for this one! Wow! That is amazing, Dad! Now I can have my drink, too! For sure! Now we can enjoy our drinks! <laughs> nice one, Dad! Looks like the parents are home! Oh! Just look at their faces! I think it was a hard day at work! Poor guys! Whoa! Oh my god! Who's attacking us? <laughs> Not again! What is happening? Kids! Of course, they can never have enough fun! Play with us! Please! We want to do something fun! No, no, no! Come on, Dad! Don't be an old man! Let's go! Here's my toy, Mom! Let's play! It seems that the parents won't get out of this! What a mess! Floors are covered in Lego blocks! Be careful, Dad! Ouch! Ah, ah, ah. What chaos! Huh? Oh no! Mom is going to be home soon! Ah, quick! I need to clean everything up! Little Lucas doesn't even care! <laughs> Dad is on the vacuum! No, Dad! Stop! You're going to ruin all my Legos! Oh, shoot! Think, Dad! I'm sure you can solve this problem easily! What's that? A sock? That doesn't belong here! Hold on a second… I think I have a pretty smart idea! I still don't understand what Dad is up to! He's putting the sock on the vacuum? 
Great, now I can clean everything up easily before mom comes home. Well, apparently the sock pack really helped out a lot. And after the sock is full, you can easily pull it off and empty it. All the Lego pieces belong in this box. Amazing, the living room looks like new again. Here comes mom. Hey, my loves. Wow, I am impressed, honey. Since when did you take care of the cleaning? Cleaning? Oh, yes, yes, I did a great job. Of course, dad. <laughs> Looks like everyone is getting ready to go to sleep. Lucas still has some energy to draw. Can you watch him while I take a shower? Yeah, I'll watch him. I think Lucas just ran out of paper. Hmm, where should I draw next, then? Oh, I know. I'll keep drawing somewhere else. Well, at least Lucas can free his imagination on the walls. <laughs> Shoot, Dad isn't reacting at all. Dad had better do something. Shoot! My goodness! What now? I was supposed to be watching you! Lucas! Stop it! Ah! We already talked about this! You can't draw on the walls or furniture! How am I going to clean this before Riley gets out of the shower? Maybe I can try this? Ah! The sponge! Maybe this will work! Aw, oh, nothing is working! I am so in trouble right now! What am I gonna do now? Riley will be so mad at me! Wait! Was that? Let me check. There is no way that sunscreen will wipe the drawings off the wall. I don't believe that. Okay, I'll give it a try. Let's see if sunscreen can do some magic. Holy moly, it works. Unbelievable. Now Dad and Lucas can get out of this pinch easily. Yay, that's right. Who has the best hacks in mind? Dad does. What's up, guys? Ah! I swear I was watching him. What? Don't mind me, our son drew this today. Lucas is really good at drawing. I know that, sweetie. Dad is not as good at lying as wiping off the walls with sunscreen. <laughs> Sweet dreams. Oh no. Mom, Dad, wake up. I need your help. I need to do my creative project. What's that? Well, it doesn't look like a creative project at all. I can't do it on my own. Kid, it's the middle of the night. I know, but I forgot that I have to present my farm project. When? Can't we do that tomorrow? Oh no, the deadline is tomorrow. Oh my god, why didn't you tell me this earlier? We better hurry. I don't understand what's happening. Okay, I'm sure we can still make it right on time. I just need some things for your farm project. Where are they? Shoot, there's nothing useful in this kitchen for Charlotte's farm project. <laughs> you look so silly right now. Hey, it's not nice to laugh at us like that. Stop it, Lucas. Hold on a second. Are those corn puffs? I think I know how to use them. Hey, I was drinking that. I know. The Midnight Art Club has just opened. Grab some corn puffs and some water. Now grab a single corn puff and dip it into the glass of water. Now try to stick them together, just like that. The water glues them together. Now you can repeat the same again and again. Just give me a moment and you'll see the best farm ever. Voila! The little house is super cute. Whoa, mom did a really great job. That looks really tasty. And also really creative. Happy birthday, Lucas. Happy birthday, son. You are getting so big. That's my boy. What an amazing celebration. Now comes everyone's favorite part of the birthday. Cake. Oh, no. Someone get the knife out of Lucas's hands. He's going to hurt himself. Oh, God. Lucas, what are you doing? No. The fingers. Watch out. One more moment and Lucas could have cut his fingers off. Hey, I want to cut the cake. What should I do? I can't let him use the real knife. Hold on. I know. I'm pretty sure I can make a fake knife out of this box. Let's see what mom is using for this hack. First of all, grab a pencil and make an outline of the real knife. Don't hurry, take your time. Then make sure you cut it nicely out of the box. See, now we have some thick material for support. The last step, let's cut the knife shape out of this green paper. Grab some pencil glue and apply it nicely to both sides of the knife. Now stick both green shapes on our first knife. And that's it. Now everyone can use this knife without getting hurt for sure. Sweetie, I have a special knife for you. Now you can be the one who cuts the birthday cake. Wow, that's amazing, Mom. Nice hack. You did a great job. 
Why is she taking so long? It's been hours. Oh my, just look at this little gentleman's clothes. He is all covered in ice cream. Whoa, what happened here, buddy? You're all dirty. Shoot, Riley will be peeved. I have to take care of it. Give me that. Ew, it's all sticky. This goes straight into the trash. No, I want my ice cream. But it's drippy and sticky. Unless... That's right, I think I have a plan. Let's see what dad has there. Hmm, is that a cupcake holder? I'm not sure if this is going to work. Okay, almost there. I just need to put it on just like that. Take it. Wow, it actually works. What a cool, simple hack for messy kiddos, right? Oh no, I think mom is coming. Hold this, son, quick. What is going on? Oh, Lucas is just helping me out with the shopping bags. Look what I got. Beautiful, isn't it? Phew. Fortunately, mom didn't notice anything suspicious. Poor Charlotte. She caught a cold a few days ago and she's still feeling sick. How is my little angel doing? I brought you some hot tea. You're going to be fine. I am going to take care of you. I have some really good medicine here. What I see from Charlotte's face is that she doesn't seem really into the meds. Open your mouth. Here comes the train. Ew! I am not going to drink this! Yikes! Gross! Well, it's not going to be easy. What is happening over here, guys? What's the problem? Lollipop! I want it! Dad, give me it! Huh? You want some sweets? Sure, Angel. There you go. Yay! Huh? Hey! That was mine! No. No candy, little lady. You are sick. What's your problem, Jack? I don't get it. Wait, look at mom. I think she just came up with a good idea. Let's see what it is. I know a trick to get Charlotte to take the meds. Let's put some cough syrup in the spoon. And now let's dip the lollipop into it. Just like that. Here, honey, you can have this lollipop. Yay! Mmm, it's so delicious. What? When I was giving her the candy, you said it was bad. One lollipop won't hurt anyone, right? Huh. Lunch time! There you go, sweetie. Yikes, Mom! I don't want to eat vegetables! Come on, don't be a rude girl. You must eat good in order to feel good, yeah? Look, Charlotte is hiding something in the drawer. French fries? She is sneaking the food without blinking. Mm -hmm. Oh, my baby is such a great kid. It's delicious, Mom! Hold on, why does it look like the food on the plate wasn't even touched? Huh? Uh-oh, someone is in trouble. Oh, I knew it. But I don't want to eat your stupid vegetables. Hmm, boring, you say? Let me think. I think I know how to make eating more fun and interesting. Sweetie, come here. The food is ready. Wow, what is all that? So many different options to eat. Let's play an eating game. Try it. Of course, mom came up with a nice way to trick kids into eating veggies and still having fun. It's like a game where whatever color you roll is the plate you have to eat from. This is such a smart move. I am impressed. And it seems that Charlotte is really having a great time now. Thanks to mom who always has cool ideas like this one. Yay, that's my girl. And mom is getting everything ready for the birthday party. Oh, I have to hurry up before the guests show up. Mom, mom. Let's play! I'm bored! Oh, sweetie, I can't! Now I have so many things to do! Here, take a lollipop! Great trick when you don't have time to play with kids! Oh, oh! No! I dropped it! Shoot! Well, it still looks delicious! Who cares? Someone, please! Stop him from licking that dirty thing! Oh, God! Lucas! Can't you see it's all dusty and dirty? You can't eat this! I'm going to give you another one! Just be more careful this time. Okay, back to business here. Mm. Oh, shoot. Not again. Mom, I dropped it again. Oh, this is going to be harder than I thought. What if I just... Look, Mom ties Lucas' hand to the lollipop. Maybe this way he won't drop the lollipop for sure? That doesn't look like a good idea. Give me that! Mom! Oh, sorry, dear. Yeah, just a moment. Where did that candy go? Huh? That was the last one, I guess. What do I do now? I think I know what to do. This hack is going to be really nice. 
Look, Mom is tying the balloons to the lollipop. I still don't have any clue why. Voila! Oh my, that's right! The balloons hold up the lollipop in the air. Oh no! Not again! No! Phew! I almost forgot. Chill out, Mom! You know it's not going to fall anymore. Isn't that amazing? It really is. There once was an old castle that was built deep in the woods. Fairy tale time before sleep. Although it seems that dad is hurrying somewhere. That girl's name was Sophia. She was a princess of mystery land. Of course. How can dad be interested in reading fairy tales when the football match is on? Hey, where are you going? Sure thing, darling. I'm not going anywhere, I promise you. Okay, let's continue. Sophia used to spend her days in woods, talking with trees and playing with wolves. She was a special girl, but one day she decided to- Oh, poor dad. I have a feeling he's missing out on all the fun with his friends. It's a really intense football match, and he doesn't even know who's winning. Get yourself over here, Jack. You're missing all the action here. Where are you going again, dad? Can't you stay with me? Being a parent is not easy. Right, Jack? Okay, okay. I'm not going anywhere. I will stay here with you, my little angel. Whoa! Okay, let's continue reading, shall we? Where did we stop? Hmm, but Sophia was so curious about the- Great, Charlotte is sleeping. Now dad can leave. Yay, my hand is free. Now I just need to leave the room. Shoot! Dad, get back here and read me my favorite fairy tale. Poor guy just wants to watch the football match in peace. Ha! You are not leaving! Got it? <laughs> of course, sweetie. So, Sophia decided to go visit the village by herself. And... Oh, Charlotte fell asleep again. You can't leave her until she falls into a deep sleep. Oh, look, maybe Dad can watch the football game here. Shoot, the stream is lagging. Ugh, this is really ticking me. Dad, can you read me more? Of course, honey. Huh? What is this look on Dad's face? Fairy tale and phone? I know! Sophia traveled for three days and three nights, but because she Wow! That is brilliant! Dad is recording himself reading a fairy tale! Got it! Now let's play! There once was an old castle that was built deep in the woods. The Watch out for the toy, Dad! You don't want to wake up Charlotte one more time, do you? Yes! Finally, I made it! Now I can go watch football with my boys! Oh no! Charlotte's favorite Barbie doll is in danger! Hey! Stop it! You're hurting my doll! No! I took her first! Whoa! The leg! The leg is off! Oopsie! Look what you've done, you monster! Now my Barbie doll is missing her leg! Dad! What happened, sweetie? Are you okay? Who hurt you? Lucas broke my Barbie's leg! Hold on, sweetie. I'm sure we can do surgery on your little doll, okay? She will be fine, I swear. Okay, it should hold. Oh, shoot. What are we going to do? I can't handle this. My little poor Barbie. Is that a 3D pen? I know. Let me handle the situation right. Now I definitely know what to do. Let's see how dad will become the hero of the day. Grab your doll and decorate it. Free your imagination. If Barbie doesn't have legs, maybe she can be a mermaid? Well, that looks interesting. Almost there. Wow, just look at the final result. It's magnificent. There you go, sweetie. She's a mermaid. Wow, Dad, I am so happy. I am so sorry for hurting your Barbie. Oh, that is so cute. Nice job, Dad. After a long day, Charlotte is peacefully sleeping. Oh no, what is that? Ah! What was that? Oh no, someone is hiding in the closet as well. Oh no! Ah! Mom, Mom! What happened, sweetie? Are you alright? He's in the closet! Huggy Wuggy is trying to attack me! Okay, see? There are no monsters here. Maybe it was just a bad dream. And another monster is under my bed. She just had a bad dream and now she thinks monsters are hiding in her room. Oh, what do I do? Maybe I can think of something for this. Hmm, I think I have an idea. Let's see what mom is up to. Grab a sprayer and some colorful stickers. Now prepare your hot glue gun and write down the name on the sprayer that will scare the monsters away. 
Now this sprayer will have superpowers to protect every single corner of the room from boogeymen and monsters. Now grab the little stickers and put them on top of the sprayer. Be creative and put as many stickers as you want. Voila! One, two, three, no! Go away, you disgusting monsters! Woohoo! No monsters! Yay! That's my brave girl. Now you can go back to sleep. Your room is safe and so are you. Wow, mom did an amazing trick here. Wait, look, what is dad doing here? Hmm, look, Riley, not that I am afraid, but maybe we could use it in our bedroom as well. Ha, dad is afraid as well. <laughs> Good night, my little angel. Have sweet dreams. <laughs>